So today, uh, me and Devin are putting our floor in today, and uh, talked yesterday about putting these blocks in ahead of time because it's much easier to pour your floor and to finish your floor. You don't get the reflection of the sun off the block onto the floor drying your edge. And this is the best part. I'll do a little demonstration. When you go to edge this floor, instead of being on knee boards, we're all the way around the floor. You reach right over the floor, do your edges. Get right in here, Doug. So when I'm doing an edge, I'll just peel some fat off like that, put it in there, trowel it the opposite way. You can reach right out there nice, hit your edges, get them all flattened out. Just like this. See how easy that is? Versus if this wall was up, this half of the basement where the sun was shining on it would be hard as a rock. That side would be totally in the shade. So your power trial would be sinking over there. You'd, You'd be burning it in over here. It'd be a total pain, but this is how easy it is. So if you're doing these walls, don't think you know you want to jump up and get the wall up and be in a huge hurry to do it because you're just costing yourself a lot of time. Um, we're gonna also demonstrate what I call half lap in the floor. So I'm gonna grab the power trowel. I'm gonna start running down the edge, and then I'm gonna lap halfway back over, and I'm gonna cover up halfway up the first pass that I did, so I'm going to do that right now.
reason we do that is to flatten the floor out. It takes all your bow float marks, your, any of your trowel lines, and if you half lap it, it'll flatten it right out. That's it for today.